this weekend I'm gonna be at Justice Tour. <laughs> Welcome if it's your first time here. Welcome back if you come back every so often. I'm so excited that you guys are here with me. I'm so excited to be sharing this excitement that I have with you guys. If you are an OG on my channel, and even if you aren't, there's one thing you should know by now, which is that I am a believer. Full on. It's like my third video on this channel was about him. Plenty of videos if you guys haven't seen them. Point is, I'm a believer. Justice the album meant a lot to me. <gasps> I had the biggest feeling that he was going to do something in March and it's called Justice and I'm so scared to read the rest of the caption. I'm just so glad he's not making us wait like three to four years in between each album. And now Justice Tour is here. I'm not going to get into all the details about Justice Tour and how I went from changes to justice. The whole ticket situation. I will be getting into that in my next video which will be the Justice Tour vlog. At the end of this week, I am going to be... God at Justice Tour. But this video is basically the week prior. It's gonna be everything that I'm doing to prepare, to pack. I have a half week, I have work, I have school, and I also have preparing for this concert to do. There's getting a plane, going to a new state. So I figured this whole process, sharing my excitement with you guys would be not only fun to do, but also great as an intro to the big bad boy, which is gonna be the next video. Follow me on Instagram and TikTok because there's loads of stuff that I'm gonna be posting on there. And that's it for this much longer intro than it had to be. I'm using a lot of lighting in this video because it's not even late in the afternoon and the sun's completely gone. So right now it's Monday. Flight leaves on Thursday. So we have today, tomorrow, and Wednesday to prepare. And then Friday is the day of the concert. I'm gonna space out all my responsibilities in terms of like YouTube work that I have to do, regular work, school work, and then work to prepare for this flight so like packing and stuff i think we could all agree that getting ready to go on a trip or like to see someone is really exciting because there's a lot of pampering to be done but i have done this kind of style of video in the past most of the times i've always failed to manage my time correctly and i'm always just like in a rush so being that it's still like three days away i have hope this being my hope that i can space out like all the time that i need for homework and shit correctly and not gonna lie to you guys making that to-do list for this week really kind of made me really overwhelmed but i think it's all gonna depend on how much i get done today before i continue on that thought we're gonna go back a day and then return back to monday hi guys i am how many days away wait let me do some quick math I'm five days away. I am at Forever 21. I'm too much of a procrastinator to have things ordered and sent on a reasonable time where I could try it out. Hence why I'm here and hence why I usually stop by here before I have something. I'm just so excited. <laughs> And now for the exciting part, I'm not gonna make you wait until like the Justice Tour diaries to see like what I wear. I don't even know if I'll end up wearing this. Like I honestly don't know what I'm gonna be wearing on tour day. But basically I found these like corduroy. Is that how you say it? Corduroy? I still can't say it. Corduroy. When it comes to what I wear to the concert, I love getting inspired by the artist. So in this case, Justin, it's pretty tough because we have Justice Tour merch, which is questionable. And then we have Drew House, which is his clothing line, which I love. Love. And then we have like just looking like cute like the basic kind of concert outfit Which is like black and like cute basically what I had in mind for this concert always since the beginning of like him dropping these albums was kind of wearing Drew House inspired or Drew House clothes and in every Drew House drops he has corduroy pants but they're like 200 bucks so I've never bought them I'm highly considering it for the tour Ooh, I bought this dress it's a black long sleeve dress it's pretty short and it has these lines going down the middle and it's honestly pretty cute you guys won't believe how much I paid for this dress I paid three dollars three this was a really good find and it's really cute Ooh, I'm so excited about 
got this one. This was so hidden. It's kind of mesh, but not really. It kind of has like a sparkly vibe and it has a collar. And then the guy at the register, he gave me this for free. So that was really sweet of him. It's just three pieces, but I feel like I have plenty of ways to dress up like the pants and the shirt separately or together. <laughs> Okay, see you. Bye. Bye. You guys, the only appointment that I'm making for like preparing for justice tour is set and done and i'm so excited it kind of just made everything real and also right now my best friend is coming to drop off tanning stuff <laughs> It's Tuesday, one day closer to leaving for Justice Tour. Today I woke up pretty early around 8 a.m. and I was working since that moment that I woke up until like 11.30, which is when I finished up my video. So now I have another video up, it's out of the way. And then I just got ready for school until I was about to leave. And I was like, you know what? Let me check my email because I have a feeling Mr. John, my professor, is going to cancel class because it's been super overcast and rainy. And I don't know why. Like, that's not really like the perfect excuse to cancel a class. I'm not complaining. But I just had a feeling he would because he's predictable. So nonetheless, he canceled class. And so that kind of made me feel better because I was already kind of really pressed with time to get to that class on time. So I got ready jamming out to my world because I'm uh, just going back to the root. I'm going to head to school anyways because a lot of the things that I have to do to prepare for this week and like be able to leave like clear headed is all the assignments that I have. I've probably done two papers all semester and this week I have like four papers due and I have to do them all today basically because tomorrow I want to focus on like packing. I still have another class so I have to be there anyways i did make an amazon order for this trip like two essentials was a pop socket because my phone hasn't had one and i got a clear fanny pack just in case i don't know what the requirements are for bags and stuff but i'm just saying it's safe so that's why i ordered it they're set to be coming around 10 p.m and before i keep talking i'm gonna head out been sitting here for so long you don't even want to know i completed basically just two assignments of like the five i came back from school straight to just like doing all the assignments that i had and i finished the ones that were due like the day of the concert that i know for a fact i won't pay attention to i just have one more left that is due on sunday but i'm not stressed about it no, yeah, we can see that you're not stressed. So yeah, I've been doing homework ever since, paper after paper. That's why I look a little rough because I forgot I had mascara and then I was rubbing my eyes. And I feel like I can breathe more because those heavier assignments are done. What we're going to do right now in the next clip is clean my Nikes because they're really the only shoes I'm going to really wear. And really the only shoes that I really have that are like sneakers. I warmed some water because some guy on YouTube said to do it. I have a toothbrush and then I have something with bleach. So I'm going to scrub and hope for the best. My Amazon order got here. Let's see what this fanny pack looks like in person. The size is great. It's a little dirty, but for what I paid, pretty decent. Oh, cute. This is the pop socket I chose. This is the color of my case. This is the only time I have to tan, but I'm just gonna be using my Bondi Sands self tanning foam in light medium. I'm using the St. Morris little pad. So I'm gonna apply this and then head off to bed. Check out this tan, you guys. I just finished my shift. I feel like my hair being done is gonna make me feel so much more ready. Hey guys, ignore the clips right now on my face. Like my lady told me never to put my hair behind my ears, which is really hard for me. So I just put these clips here to avoid that. Since I didn't introduce today, it's already Wednesday. I already worked this morning. I already did my hair. And honestly, I felt so like physically drained after work today. So I rested and now it's already 5 p.m. So I'm already technically gonna be awake for 12 hours. I have yet to start packing and that's what we're gonna do now. 
As always, would love to show you the real reality of what my room tends to look like before an outing of any kind. Now that it's officially packing time, I have to decide which bag to take. Now this is usually never an issue because I just take my regular suitcase, but this time around, I have something really personal against paying nearly 40 bucks just to take my things. So my plan is basically to just take a carry-on and a personal item because that's what it said in the email would be free. I have this carry-on, pretty decent size. It's looking like this is going to be the one that makes the most sense. Even though I was thinking very unrealistically, thinking that all my belongings could fit in here. Just because it's cuter, less hassle. But I think it's just more efficient to take the rolling one. Before I start picking clothes and ideas i have to check out the weather so tomorrow morning it's going to be in the 60s the afternoon it goes up to 78 so it's not as hot but also friday has a low of 40 and saturday has a low of 36 so this definitely means incorporating some kind of jacket I've had friends to keep me sane through all of this, thank God. I actually narrowed it down pretty well. I have three pants, which I think is very reasonable because they're each different colors, just in case I want a blue jean moment, black pant moment, or cream. And then I have like basics, again, from every color. I have cream, white. I feel like they're all very appropriate for the weather. I think that's it. I'm taking some pants, the shirt I bought, two going out shirts, and a dress. Now for the exciting part. So I'm gonna show you guys my mini mini Drew House collection. So this one is very unfortunate because it has a stain But this is my favorite and then we have Drew on a pink donut and then my first ever Drew House item Which was the classic smiley face Drew and these are all in the size large Drew House is all about like oversized Kind of one size not technically but very much that vibe drew house obviously came after the last tour so then i just figured that this would be kind of what people or believers would be wearing so i'm bringing it and yeah <laughs> guys it's a couple hours later and my suitcase is ready to go i'm nearly ready to go here i have all the jewelry that i'm gonna put on tomorrow in my personal item i'm taking like a mirror another camera my jewelry lashes and then the essentials like airpods and my wallet here i have the clothes that i will wear tomorrow my shoes are outside and yeah this is the clear fanny pack that i showed you guys earlier um i'm probably gonna use this for my toiletries but i still need them tomorrow morning and also my mom helped me out a lot with ironing these for me so now they're perfect and ready to go and now it's just a matter of hours until we get on the plane I have a tradition where I always, when there's any kind of situation where I'm going to see Justin, I wear one of his perfumes. Luckily, I have a small one of the key. They say that I can take up to 3.4, so I should be all set. Now it's the morning. I'm literally about to leave the house. I'm pretty much all ready. My suitcase and jacket are ready. I just... I didn't make my bed, but whatever. And my purse is ready to go. I just have to zip it up. Originally, I was just going to wear the sweatpants with Drew House and just like go fully decked in Justin. But I wanted to wear something that I could like take off the jacket just in case I get like hot. So I wore this top from Sheen. The sweatpants that I'm wearing are from Justin's original merch page and fan page, which is beaverfever.com. They say beaver across the back. They were gifted to me by my dad over 10 years ago and they still fit. And when I first got them, they were were pretty big so i'm so grateful how that worked out because i can still wear it to this day and it's time for me to get out so i don't miss my flight i'm off to the airport so excited i've never had this energy at 5 a.m or 6 a.m even though i wake up at 6 a.m all the time and i actually just made a video about waking up at that time every day for a week it's never felt like this i'm now in the car so ready to get through this flight so that i could hop on the next one and then i can arrive <laughs> Five days away. 